Hey everybody, it's Michelle from Schmoopy TV, and I thought it would be fun to restart my Animal Crossing New Horizons because we have started new games on population growing for the GameCube, um, Wild World, City Folk, New Leaf, <laughs> it's hard to name them all. Um, so I thought it would be fun to just restart here as well and just going with the theme. We'll call it Fun Island. <laughs> I know that's a dumb name, but I think it's funny. So that's why I like to call my uh, towns and cities and now island. It'll just be Fun Island. So um, let's just get started and see what we can create here. I should have actually pulled up the uh, keyboard on my phone. I don't know why I didn't do that. I'm gonna go ahead and do that right now. Okay. Take a picture. Okay, let's do girl. And I'm fair skinned. Let's do, I always do this hairdo. But I think I'm gonna keep it that way. And then my hair is blonde. It's more like that. Let's check out all the eyes. I think I like these the best. I'm pretty sure that's what I use every single time. Yeah. We'll stick with that. Let's check out the different noses. I like the round nose. I like that mouth. And then, should we do blush? Oops. Yeah, let's do blush this time. Okay. Okay, we have to do Northern Hemisphere. Um, what I'm excited about this is redoing my museum because I like to write down every month what bugs and fish and sea creatures and all that stuff to get, so it'll be fun to refill the uh, museum again. So basically every month, um, I would say at the start of every month, I'll go through and do like one day dedicated to fish, one day dedicated to insects, one day dedicated to sea creatures, and then every month we can do those type of videos where we need to specifically look for that and the other games i'm going to do that also because i have the like the nintendo power guides and i'm not sure if they specifically tell you i know some of them tell you specifically what month each um fish and insect and sea creature are on so we'll look through that and do that as well okay so Let's check this these maps out. Um, let's find out which one we want. This one's a little bit more simple, I think. I think I kind of like this one the most. Now let there this side. It's always hard to choose. I mean, it, at the end it really doesn't matter, but I don't know. I'm kind of particular. Okay, so the nooks, or I mean, uh, resident services. Yeah, let's do this one. I think I like this one. It's different than anything I've ever done before. Okay, sleeping bag, a lamp, some food, something to kill time. Let's do probably, well, food. Let's do food. Okay. 
Okay. Have I not named my island yet? Or did I? Oh, I can't wait to see who my villagers are. That's always exciting. This is such a beautiful um, entrance to the game. Intro, I mean, not entrance. Intro. orientation in the plaza. Who is that? Is that Sprocket? I don't know. Okay, where is the plaza? I thought it was right there. Maybe it's over here. Here we go. Mira. Yep, Sprocket. I thought so. Get our tent and set it up. I think it's this guy, right? All right, now we have our map and our tent. All right, let's go. Let's check out our map. I think we'll set up our house like right up here. Yeah, right up here in the corner. Perfect. Gonna set up the other villagers' tents. Where'd Sprocket go? I just saw him. Maybe because I took around his spot he left. Where is 
everybody at? Here we go. I'll find you a spot. I think I'm gonna do them kind of in a line. So let's go kind of over here, very top, and then I'll line up all the houses, I think. It's a little bit too close. Maybe like right here. Let's wait for the map to pull up. Yeah, we'll just do it. Okay, now let's go find Mira. Oh, I have oranges. I just realized that. I've never had oranges before. It's exciting. Alright, I'll find you a spot. Okay. I'm gonna try to line it up perfect with Sprocket, but it's pretty hard to do. Let's do it maybe like right here. Let me look at the map. Am I on the line? I don't know. Maybe I should have stayed where I was, but let's check. Oh, that's pretty close. Let me imagine it. Yeah. Perfect. Okay. Oh, it takes you right back. I was gonna say I was gonna gather oranges, but we'll have to wait. Few supplies. We'll need sticks and oranges. Ten tree branches. I don't remember how many oranges, but we'll just go ahead and do like nine. fall anymore because of the weed being in the way. So let's pick these up and we'll just shake it again. Are we at nine? No, eight. Come on. There we go. Let's go ahead and get the oranges out of the way while we're out here. And I'll pick up all these weeds when um, I save the game. I'm not gonna bore you with watching me do that. And that would be ridiculous. Okay, I don't know if you need nine, but let's see. Oh, six of them. Six. <clears throat> Excuse me. Six oranges and ten tree branches. Oh, 
We're going to call it fun. <laughs> I like to see what the characters come up with. They're always funny names. All right, let me use this keyboard on the phone. Failed to send. Oh man. Well, never mind. I had to turn my Wi Fi off, so obviously that's why. <laughs> Wasn't thinking there. Fun! Awesome Beach, Buffburg, Tim Town. Oh, I missed the last one. Absolutely. Resident representative of fun. That's what they call me. Howdy. <laughs> So, I think now you have to go sleep, right? It's been a while since I've uh, restarted my island, but I think you have to talk to him and he tells you to go to sleep. Camping cot. Okay. Let's talk to these guys and then go. I feel like I'm on vacation, but we actually get to live here. Resort. I've never settled an island before. Fun, this is gonna be rad, Cottontail. <laughs> Alright, let's unpack our stuff and go to sleep. This fir first part takes a while. It's already been 21 minutes. That's crazy. Alright, let's open up our radio and our lantern. Let's turn it on. Move this over. I'm actually going to put my bed in the middle. I usually always put everything to the left and then put my bed on the right side. But this time, I'm going to put it in the middle. Oh my gosh, my throat just made a weird noise. Okay. I like these colors, so I might have gotten a cool uh, color for my airport. I mean, it doesn't matter once you unlock the uh, uh, Cyrus at Harv's Island, but in the meantime, it'll be nice to have some cute colors before you're able to uh, customize them however you want. KK, looks like you've decided to make your own way into the world. Get out there, explore new frontiers. That's all the way right, Daddy-O. You don't need to live by anyone's rules but your own. The world was made for exploring, you know? Living free, being out there, it's a great feeling. Yeah, but take it from a cat who's been on the road. Being by your lonesome can grind on the soul. You have gotta make friends along the way. Rambling this crazy world is Squaresville without some pals. Yeah, man, friends are where it's at. Speaking of rambling, I'm doing a bit of that myself, my bad. 
Maybe it's about time for you to wake up to your new life. Oh, but listen up. That rap I just gave you about friends, it's pretty key. You'll dig this island a whole lot island life a whole lot more if you share it with some friends, if that's your scene. Yeah, an island paradise with your best pal sounds pretty groovy to me. Cool, when you wake up, you'll be in sync with real time. Dig that island life and I'll catch you later. I hope the volume's okay. It kind of sounds quiet to me, but I'm worried about turning it up. I don't want it to blare. What do you want? There you are. I hope you had a pleasant nap. Or, well, I suppose it was a bit more than a nap, wasn't it? It was a brand new day. I slept that long? Oh, ho, ho. Yes, it's quite normal to be worn out from such a long trip and a major life event. Speaking of which, I have a few more things that you might find useful as you adjust to life in our little paradise. First, you need one of these... Yes... My cell phone. My nook phone. I'm gonna make sure it's working. Turn it on. Sure have. Um, uh, I don't really need it, but why not? Let's just do it. You never know. Itemized bill. This includes everything, airfare, accommodations, labor, tax, and of course, your Nook phone. Bringing your grand total to the modest sum of 49,800 bells. Wait, you don't have any bells? I can't believe I didn't think of this. Ah, oh, of course. Well, no need to worry. I was prepared for exactly this type of tricky situation. For the uh, getaway package, you can pay your fees with miles instead of the standard bells. I call this extremely helpful service, the Nook Mileage Program. You can earn miles by simply living life here on fun. I dare say the more you enjoy your island life, the more Nook miles you can earn. And you can use them to pay back your move-in fees and much more. So the bottom line is you'll need 49,800 bells to pay your move-in fees. But with this new service, you uh, would you believe it, it only comes to 5,000 miles. I'll just go ahead and register you so you can pay in miles. Yes, yes, but there are more details available within your Nook phone. Just open the Nook Miles app. And you'll see that you've earned some miles just for traveling to the island and joining the program. Now, if you'll excuse me, I must get back to a few other matters. But let me heartily congratulate you once again on your arrival. I'm so happy to have you as a resident on Fun, a client of Nook, Inc. Okay, let's check our mail and get started. I can do whatever I want. From now on, island time will match the flow of time in the real world. Okay. All right, let's pull up our Nook Miles. Okay. Okay, 500. Let's go ahead and take a photo 
to get some miles from that. Perfect. Oops. Island Shutterbug. 300. Just open everything up, get everything going, and then we will check our mail. All right, passport. Add a short comment. Let's edit this because you get um, you get um, points for this. Also, add a short comment to your profile. That's right. Yay. <laughs> I'm so awkward when it comes to this kind of stuff. I just don't know what to write. <laughs> Obviously, I think you guys knew that because I title all of my games as fun, so. Okay. Deserted Island. Mama. <laughs> That's stupid. <laughs> okay, let's see. What all do we have here? Oh, they have city folk? That's cute. Oh, I bet you can just put Animal Crossing. Let's see. Yep, you sure can. Animal Crossing. Perfect. Okay, how much? 300. So we're getting somewhere. Now, what is this? Horde reward. Go ahead and be shellfish. <laughs> I can't say. Shellfish. Pick of the bunch, flower power. You've got the bug, angling for perfection, island togetherness, okay. Oh, we forgot to open one, sorry about that. Last thing. Actually, I didn't open the rescue, but we're not doing that right now, so. What did we get from Nintendo? Congratulations on your big move. We hope you enjoy your new island life. To celebrate this fresh start, we'd like to give you a gift that is sure to come in handy. What did we get? I'm excited to find out. Simple DIY workbench. Okay, we can't learn anything yet. Okay. So let's go pick up some things to sell. Ah, oh, it disintegrated. I didn't think about that. Should have picked up that weed first. My bad. Hello. Yo, Michelle. I'm getting a real good vibe from the tent plot you picked for me. Thanks for the hand. We've got to look out for each other here. If you ever need anything, don't be shy, Cottontail. Oh, yeah. I was thinking about how to thank you, and I came up with a recipe for a leaf umbrella. Cool. All right, so first thing I thought when I got here was, no, that's a lot of weeds. That's kind of where I got the idea. It's a DIY project that uses weeds. If, you ever, if you've never done a DIY project before, you should ask Tom Nook to help you out. He's doing free DIY demos over at Resident Services. Okay. Let's go pick up some shells. None. Right there. Tiger butterfly. All right, no dice, we only got one. <laughs> okay, are these automatically going in groups? Okay, perfect. I couldn't remember if they did or not. We'll also start picking up these rocks and um, sticks and stuff like that, just so we can get some supplies. Campfire was a lot of fun. We're keeping resident services open at night, so feel free to stop by if you need to talk about anything. For the time being, I'll be out and about checking with everyone, seeing how folks are doing. If you're ever unsure about what you should do, don't hesitate to stop for a chat. Okay. Sprocket. Yo, Michelle, that spot you found for me is just incredible. Thanks. I hope we can 
keep looking out for each other like this. It's good to have buddies. Oh, right. I've got something here for you. Thanks again for finding a place for my place. That's a mesh cap. It's perfect for fun. You can try uh, try it on by pressing X, okay? Choose where, yep. Let's wear it. Not the cow uh, cowrie. Yay, Nintendo hat. Purple. Oh, we got points. Three hundred. Moving on up. Okay. Oh, that was stupid. I'm glad they didn't fall. I don't know why they didn't fall, but I'm very happy. <laughs> they would have all been ruined. That's probably why they didn't fall. Perfect. Okay. Let's keep going around and collecting everything we can. I'm just not learning my lesson here, apparently. Okay, let's go to the bulletin board. Island bulletin board. We use this board to post important notices and other useful bits of information for everyone. Yes, yes. Island residents and visitors alike should feel free to use this bulletin board and communi to communicate with each other, celebrate special events, and more. I wonder if we create a post, we'll get some points. Let's just do something generic and just say, welcome to fun. My keyboard's spazzing out. Or, I mean, not my keyboard, my, um... What the heck this thing called? Joystick. No. I'm not done. Hit the wrong button. Okay. Hopefully we'll get points for that. Yep. Three hundred. Perfect. Okay, we officially have three shells. <laughs> this and then we'll go get our five tree branches. Okay. 
perfect. Okay, let's go get our tree branches and collect our points for selling our items. Let's get our tree branches. Five of them. I don't want to get stung right away, so I'm just going to pick up the ones that are on the ground. Is that five? Pick up a couple more weeds because I think you need 10 weeds for that DIY. Let's go. It's always so fun to restart games. DIY recipes. Okay. Let's learn these and then we will make the, um, I think it's a leaf umbrella. Yeah, leaf umbrella. And then we'll go fishing to earn some more nook miles. Oh, you need 15. Wow. Okay. So hardwood, iron nugget, tree branch, and tree branch. Okay. So let's go collect that, make a couple things, and then start catching bugs and fish. Taking them to Tom Nook, and then it'll get things going. Okay, it should be 15. Yep. Oh, let's go over here. That's a cute little area. I like that. I like how it's set up. Okay. Let me get these oranges. And then we'll shake this tree so we know we're not going to get stung without our net. just something that you're always going to need in the beginning because you always have to redo your fishing poles, your nets. They um, don't last very long. Come on. Okay, well, this is good enough anyway, but I just thought I would go ahead and shake that tree, but it's just taking too long. I don't have the patience. 
I see a water beetle over here that we can catch when we come back out. Okay, let's go back. Yeah, I think I really like this setup. It's really cute. It's way different than anything I've ever had before. I've had, um, when I first bought the game, I made an island and then I restart that one. And so that is the game that is on my other Switch. That's my main uh, New Horizons game on my stream. And then um, I have another system with a different game and I've restarted this about I don't know four or five times all right let's make a net and then we'll make one more net so that way we have two of each and we'll make a campfire just for fun Okay, let's sell our oranges and then we will go catch some stuff. And then we'll end the stream. Oh, you know what's funny is I was supposed to make that, um, <laughs> what's it called? The leaf umbrella. Oh well, I spaced it and I sold them. Who cares? No biggie. Let's start with uh, bug hunting. Let's see if this beetle is still here. It'd be uh, the odds are pretty low that it's still there. But I figured I would check. Butterfly! Got it! Yellow butterfly! Okay, our first catch. Is that one coming over here? The common butterfly? Too far away, I think. Yeah. Thought it was gonna come closer. We can sell that one. Turn the other one in. They're not worth anything, but you need all the help you can get in the beginning. Was I just seeing something? Yeah, I thought so. Tiger butterfly, and then I need to go get that grasshopper. Dung beetle. Okay, I hear something. Where's it at? There it is. Oops. Oh. <laughs> I can't see where it's at. There it is. Okay. Oh my goodness. Got it. I got you, little sucker. I was on a roll, now I'm missing everything. There we go. Now we'll go turn these in and switch to fishing. Actually, do we have room? Let's go ahead and catch this. And then we will switch to fishing and get a couple of fish. And that's why you want to make a couple because they do not last at all. Let's get our nook miles. Oh, you've got the bug. Perfect. So 10 and then 100. 
Anything else? Trash tools. One and then 20. Okay. And then once I start pulling these weeds, I'll uh, get some more points. But like I said, I'm not going to do that right now. That would be very boring. It's peaceful for me. I, I really like doing it, but I mean, I, it'll be boring for you guys to watch. I would never do that on stream. Oh, cool. Puffer fish. It's pretty. That's a different one. That's a locust. Oh my gosh, now he's gonna go in the water. Got him. Long locust. Okay, where are we at here as far as space? Put this over here. Campfire. Dragonfly. Sometimes I have to, uh, close my eyes when I'm fishing because I'll get nervous and I'll push the button too early. So I saw a tip on a video a long time ago and it said if you close your eyes you won't be tempted to push the button so and it works every single time. So if you're having trouble uh, with the timing close your eyes and you'll never miss. <clears throat> Fly fish. Those are so pretty. Let's swap it with our yellow butterfly. Let's catch this one and then we'll run back to resident services. I think we've caught enough stuff. Horse mackerel. Okay, we'll let that go. Actually, it's probably more than the yellow butterfly. So let's switch it. We'll swap those. Now let's run back and give everything that we found and caught to Tom Nook. found a creature. No way tied to your generous donation just now, but I have a useful app to show you. Sure, Tom Nook. Sure. All right, we got our Critterpedia. Okay, now 
we're getting our DIY recipes. Perfect. Flowers, what we get red cosmos. Okay. Crossbreeding and rare colors. Perfect. Oh, cool. Watering can. Okay, I have more, Tom. Pufferfish. Uh oh, his phone's ringing. Hold the phone, someone's calling. Who could it be? Blathers! You remember the adventure we discussed? Well, it's come to fruition. I am currently stationed on an island that we've decided to call Fun. Yes, yes, the local fauna are as abundant as expected, just as I told you. Hmm, how many precisely, you asked? Well, there's no way of knowing just yet, but I have received, let's see, five outstanding specimens so far. What, seriously? Well, that is very exciting. Oh, but you'll have to excuse me. I'm with the customer right now. <laughs> I'm sorry to keep you waiting. That was my friend Blathers, the one who curates a museum. Believe it or not, he's going to come to our island and help us identify and preserve the local creatures. But I could use your help. Since you've done so much scouting and collecting already, would you be able to find a spot for Blathers? We'll need a good sized space to really build out a world class museum, so do keep that in mind. This is exciting, it's all coming together. Alright, let's go find a spot and let's collect our Nook Miles points. And then we'll, let's organize our pockets so I know exactly. Um, okay, we have not donated the grasshopper. And then this right here, long locust, the earth boring dung beetle, and dragonfly. Because so I think we donated, uh, did we donate a horse mackerel? I don't remember, so I'm going to put it over here just in case. Okay, let's collect our points. Critterpedia. Okay, so I did. I did do that. Okay, I don't know why I opened it back up, but I did uh, donate the uh, horse mackerel. Okay, so he gave us the birdhouse, axe, watering can, Bonfire, tiki torch, and log stakes. All right, we're moving right along. Let's open up our map. Let's kind of see where we want to do this. I kind of want to keep it all along this route right here. So let me go in the middle of this line and kind of go straight across, maybe right here. Let's see what it looks like. I wish they would show you the map according to where it is. B 
before you say yes, but oh well, we'll just do this. Let's see where it lines up. Yeah, I mean, it's not bad. Let's go behind it here. Yeah, that's not too bad. It's on the line, so that's perfect. Okay, now let's go back and see what else we need to do. I knew this first video was going to be kind of long, so I apologize for that. There's no really getting around it. I didn't know you could buy the trees in bulk. I don't really buy them though, so it makes sense why I didn't know that. I don't know if that's new or not. Okay, let's check this. Let's just keep getting our points here. do I have on? I don't remember. Oh, I don't have enough bells. Okay. Oh yeah, I have on these jeans. Okay, let's go. Now the frying pan, stone stool, old fashioned wash tub, wood block toy, ocarina, and hay bed. Look, phone life. Shop to it. Oops. Perfect. 
first time buyer. Okay. Let's go plant some trees and stuff and that way we'll get some more points. Let's plant these around our little tent. Our little flowers. I'm gonna put them on the side. new rice grasshopper I thought it looked different okay all right let's plant our cosmos and we'll do our lilies right here Oh, I have four of them. Okay. I didn't realize that. Well, I'm gonna wait on the rest. So let's just drop that right now. How am I not getting nook points for this? <laughs> why I bought them. Oh well, it's okay. Okay, let's make our... Oh, I did get no points. I just didn't hear it, I guess. Oh. Hmm. It's weird. Alright, our rice grass grasshopper. And our slingshot. Okay, uh, let's check out our axe. What do we need to make that? Stone and tree branch, okay. Come on, branches. Acorn. Cool. I don't think I have that butterfly. Yeah, monarch. Perfect. Excuse me, Sprocket.
I'm going to make the uh, axe and then we're going to go bang on the uh, rocks and try to find the money rock. Almost there, we are so close. Good enough. Better than not having anything. And now we can start stocking up on our supplies from day one. For when we have to build all of those houses and all of that stuff. All of the supplies that go, not the houses, but the supplies that go with the houses. All of the furniture. sure I was gonna miss it. Perfect. Now our money's back up. We have more points. Let's see where we're at. Nice. We're moving right along here. Once we uh, get that 5,000 points, that's when we'll end the episode. These are all going to be for when Blathers is here tomorrow. Okay.
Boot. Hopefully I get points for that. Nope. New DIY, recycled boots. Where'd that darner uh, dragonfly go? Tiger. Wow. A boot and a tire. Tire toy. I don't know if I was on it or not. Perfect! A black bass. Alright, how many more fish do I need to catch to get some points? Angling for, okay, two more, perfect. Let's take this back to our pile. Oh. Papa bear, aw, that's cute. Oh, you can't put it outside? Oh, it's a big one. Wow. Exterior decorator. 300 more. Yes, we finally did it. I kind of want to do the two more fish and then we'll go pay off, um... But I mean, we can just go ahead and we can go ahead and just um, do it now. No big deal. So let me put this down: the sweet fish and the black bass. And we'll go pay it off, and we'll call it a day. This has been fun. And then uh, when I log off, I will get rid of all these weeds, so they'll be gone tomorrow when we play. I really enjoy making these videos. Moving fees. You're free and clear of debt, living on a thriving scenic island. What could be better? Oh, that wasn't actually a rhetorical question. Let me be more specific. How is that tent treating you? Fine, but consider doing fine on a formerly deserted island is actually quite good. Together, we were reshaping this barren waste, I mean, 
pristine paradise into a lovely community. <laughs> ah, yes, but we mustn't rest on our laurels, hmm? Perhaps there is more we could do. Yeah, I suppose this time... The time is right to discuss the possibility of building custom homes. Now, there are certain challenges to building fabulous homes in a remote location such as this. Challenges that do translate directly into cost, I'm afraid. And, but with zero interest financing and an extremely lax repayment plan, anything is possible. So Michelle, if you ever find yourself interested in a new home, do come and see me. One more thing to share. We have a miles redemption service for the Nook miles you've collected. When you access the Nook, Nook stop, you'll be able to redeem your miles for lots of interesting things. You'll be sure to check it out sometime soon, huh? Well then, I hope you continue to enjoy your getaway package life. Ninety-eight thousand bells. Let's do it. Um, I always do either red or black, but I just really like red and black. I think I'm gonna go with red. I mean black. <laughs> I said red. <laughs> Okay, we did it. Let's check our points. Now we have Nook Miles Plus. We will have a house when we log in tomorrow. We paid off our moving fees and Blathers is coming tomorrow as well. So we are moving right along. I really hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.